hey hi guys welcome back so today we will see uh one thing how we can handle the auto suggest uh, web edit or uh, drop down okay let me quickly show you the website okay this is one sample website for orange um, hrm okay and this is the new page which i you can see in my screen and here um, you can see few drop downs are there this okay and and this is the one which i was talking about like auto suggest web edit okay so if you write something it will give some suggestion to select okay options to select so we will see both uh, this drop down as well and as well as this auto suggest uh, this drop down uh, i am covering here because um, sometimes what will happen uh, whenever you will scan any uh, drop down it will show um, as a division okay as a div okay and it won't show as a proper drop down where you will just uh, give the option and uh, normally it will go and it will select okay so we'll see how we can handle this both control quickly uh, let me open uh, tosca and let me scan See, I have selected uh, scan this drop down. It is showing as uh, you can see here. It is showing tag as div. Okay, and this is not unique because there are multiple drop downs for that. Um, mostly class will also be same. See here, once I selected class, even though it is not unique. Okay, so uh, we can we can make use of other identification okay to make it unique but um, we need uh, the options from here okay this options to select okay but this is not showing as drop down so what we will do we will um, select one of this option okay and then we'll work with this control okay but the problem is uh, I am opening uh, clicking on this drop down you can see the uh, another division has opened okay this is uh, again a div okay and in that we can see the different options but when as soon as I click uh, on Tosca this is getting disappeared okay so what we can do we for, to handle such scenarios there are two to three ways are there okay so one way I will show you which I have already shown in one of my videos to disable the JavaScript so what you should do just press F12 key okay this will open um, okay and then just select on the drop down and click on the setting button you will see uh, one option disable JavaScript just click on that just drag it bit down and now try to scan okay this time you will be able to scan this it will not get disappeared because we have disabled the javascript okay let's select tag okay and then you can see this is showing as a division let's click on select on screen first make this as unique we will use anchor tag okay and what is that tag show live with the status okay 
so we'll make use of the label okay just drag and drop here okay so we will just show leave with status this will give show leave okay and then division let's exp expand the filter and see you can see your different uh, options which is available under this particular div so we will select one of the uh, option okay and we'll select the inner text as well okay and let's save it okay let's close it and let's see let me drag and drop under tosca training we'll drop down okay we drop down demo first let's see this division if you click here it is showing the options available this is how um, normal drop down it will show so we will try to select one of this option and then let's see whether this works or not let me disable enable the javascript otherwise it will be in second whenever you uh, disable the javascript don't forget to disable it okay now let's try to run the same steps so this will not work it is failed okay so what we have to do in such scenario we have already scanned this particular uh, drop down okay we'll click on that and we'll select one of this option so by default i have selected one option called reject so what we will do first First, we will uh, try with reject only. Okay. Let me quickly run that. it clicked on uh, drop down select and as well it selected uh, reject as well okay you can see here that it has clicked on reject okay so obviously this will work because i have already scanned and here we have uh, in a text rejected so what if we want to select a different value from reject suppose i want uh, to select taken so what we can do here let's take one tbox set buffer drag and drop here okay instead of hard code we will pass one buffer here buffer of option okay buffer of option let me copy this buffer name and we will define the same buffer here 
and we will provide the value which we want to select okay so what will happen as soon as i run the script the control will come here it will see uh, the buffer option which is set to taken it will go to the next step it will click on this uh, show leave okay division then it will come here at reject it will check the property in a text is buffer of option which is buffer of option is taken so it will click on taken option just uh, let's run and see whether it will work as expected or not so it has clicked on uh, the drop down and selected um, taken okay the same way you can select any of the label option okay this is for the drop down when it is showing as a division okay the same thing when you work with auto suggest uh, control okay like this if it is uh, if you type a it is showing uh, available option okay so i mean same thing when you will go uh, for a scan this particular division will get disappeared so what you have to do just press f12 okay then you just click on the drop down just type something okay then you disable the javascript okay then try to scan again okay select on screen select this and then this division Okay, let me enable the JavaScript, close this window, okay. and then this is not unique, try to make it unique using anchor, employee name, okay, and Second one is division. Let's select one of this option. Select uh, inner text. Okay. So this division. okay that's fine because we have disabled it is not enabled that's why it is showing like this that's fine just save it and close it drag and drop into the same test case this time we will enter something here like a and then we will just give for click okay let's quickly run that it entered a But that option it is not showing whatever division we were expecting okay so what we will do here just stop it and instead of passing a we will use send case and we will pass the 
same okay. let's run again and see Okay, it entered. Now it selected the available option. Okay, so for example, after typing A, we want to select this time as Peter Mac Anderson. Okay, this value we want after typing A. Okay, okay, whatever options we are selecting, it is getting. Um, okay, one second. We want Peter Mac Anderson. Okay, so what we will do here? Let me just save this. Uh, sorry, assign to this buffer, and how we have passed in um, the previous step that buffer. Same, we will copy and paste for this uh, on drop down as well okay so this time it should select different option okay whatever we have provided in the buffer which is peter uh, starting with peter So it has selected uh, whatever buffer we have provided okay in the first step okay okay guys so this is how you can handle this auto suggest control as well as uh, drop down when it will uh, show as a division okay and yeah that's all for this uh, scenarios or uh, session guys thank you so much for your support and uh, thank you guys bye bye